Ray by Ray, an early June sunrise awakens the Pine Ridge country of northwest Nebraska. Mule deer, elk, and bighorn sheep hoof this high country. Since the early 1990s, another majestic animal, most from the Black Hills of South Dakota, have established a growing presence in the state. In response, Nebraska Game and Parks is working to increase knowledge of the big cats. We have recently uh, documented a, a local reproducing population of mountain lions, and we wanted to come up and learn more about this population. Let's go. We take trained uh, detection dogs that will look for mountain lion sign, mainly mountain lion scat. Laboratory analysis of scat DNA will provide many answers, including... Say we collect 10 or 20 different scats, it could give us an idea of a minimum number of mountain lions that are present in the Pine Ridge, and also what gender they are. And then beyond that, it can tell us how they're related. So it could say, the scat you collected on June 10th is the daughter of the scat you collected on June 5th. Train, a Chesapeake Bay Retriever, seemed hot on a scent within 15 minutes. The biologists expect wildlife watering areas to be closely watched by cougars. Across a valley from the watering site, Train sniffs something atop the ridge. That's impressive nose work as the deposits were several weeks old. Wait, wait. They can find samples under snow, underground, um, floating on oceans. How far away depends a lot on the terrain, the sun, the wind, a lot of different factors, but they've been documented several hundred feet. Did you find it? These dogs are completely play oriented. That's how we choose them. They're almost all rescue dogs on top of that. So basically all we do, you can teach any dog to find any scent that you want. So basically we equate a puma scat in this case to a tennis ball, which is their ultimate reward in life. Follow-up lab work will reveal much more information and potentially shape a management plan for cougars in Nebraska. Anytime you, you hope to have a, a future season, a hunting season, you have to have baseline data and um, mountain lions are fully protected right now by game law. But of course, just like all of our uh, wildlife species, we'd like to have a good idea of what their population is doing, especially animals like mountain lions that draw so much attention from the public. In this study, two teams of dogs and biologists search for mountain lion sign. The eventual study results will make the northwest Nebraska mountain lion population a little less mysterious.